Hello, YouTube. Despite being quite close to us, the Earth's core is still a mysterious structure. An international team of scientists has uncovered the mystery of this strange layer E located at the boundary of the Earth core. The results of the study published in the journal Nature Geoscience in 2023 change our understanding of the interaction between the core and the mantle of the planet. Layer E is also known as CMB from core mantle boundary. Its thickness is only a few hundred kilometers. For a long time, the existence of this layer puzzled scientists since the mechanism of its appearance was not completely understood. New research has shown that layer E is formed by the action of water that seeps from the Earth's surface into the depths of the mantle. In the 1990s, geologists discovered a thin layer surrounding Earth's outer core, a swirling ocean of liquid metal that surrounds the solid inner core. The layer, dubbed the E-prime layer or E-layer, is more than 60 miles, 100 kilometers thick. Relatively slim compared with other sections of the Earth's interior, and sits around 1,800 miles or 2,900 kilometers beneath Earth's surface. The researchers believe it probably took more than 1 billion years for the E layer to reach its current thickness, meaning it could be older than the inner core, which solidified around 1 billion years ago. For billions of years, water has penetrated and is penetrating into the bowels of the Earth through faults in tectonic plates. Having reached the boundary of the core and mantle at a depth of about 3,000 kilometers, it enters into a chemical reaction with the core materials. This leads to the formation of a layer rich in hydrogen and depleted in silicon. Laboratory experiments conducted by scientists under high pressure Simulating conditions in the bowels of the planet confirmed this theory. They also show that a film structure forms in the upper part of the outer core, which leads to the formation of silica crystals. Rising into the mantle, these crystals change the density of the liquid metal layer and seismic velocities. The data are consistent with anomalies previously detected by seismologists. Dan Shim, one of the leading researchers, noted, this discovery changes our understanding of the interaction between the core and the mantle of the Earth. It shows that this interaction is more significant and dynamic than we previously thought. In September 2022, the same research team discovered that leaking water could be reacting with large reservoirs of carbon in the outer core to create gigantic diamond factories near the core mantle boundary. Well, this new series of experiments has shown that the mysterious E prime layer, which surrounds Earth's outer core is created by the water that leaks deep into our planet's interior. Scientists may have finally found the cause of this mysterious crystal forming layer that surrounds the Earth's core, a leaking water that trickles down into the Earth's surface and reacts, reacts with our planet's metallic heart. See, scientists previously theorized that the E layer was left behind by ancient iron-rich magma. Other theories posited that it leaked out of the inner core or formed during the Earth collision with a protoplanet that birthed the moon and left chunks of the infant world inside Earth. But none of these ideas have been widely accepted. I, By the way, I urge you to look at my videos about mysteries of the moon too. You'll find them in the playlists in my channel. So in the new study published in Nature Geoscience, 
Researchers discovered that the E layer was likely created by water that leaks down from Earth's surface via subducting or sinking tectonic plates, then reacts with the outer coarse metallic surface. If a new, the new finding is correct, it means that the E layer has produced large quantities of silica crystals as a byproduct of this reaction, which have been fed into the mantle, the massive layer of magma that sits between the outer court, core and the earth outer crust. So in the study, they conducted a series of laboratory experiments to replicate how water could react with the outer core under intense pressure. This revealed that the hydrogen from the water replaces the silica within the liquid metal, which forces the silica out of the metal in the form of crystals. The E layer is therefore likely a hydrogen rich and silica depleted layer of the outer core, which goes against previous assumptions about its composition. The new finding is another sign that our current understanding of how the outer court and mantle interact with one another maybe is incomplete. Um, it's very interesting um, because I already told you that they, uh, the same research team discovered that leaking water could be reacting with the large reservoirs of carbon in the outer court to create gigantic diamond factories near the core mantle boundary. Imagine, imagine the uh, ramifications. Earth's mysterious core is weirder and stranger than we think, and we're just only beginning to uncover its secret. Also remember, the inner core may be spinning and scientists think it's encased by an ancient ocean floor. And also scientists in China said recently that they've solved a major mystery deep inside the earth by confirming that the inner core wobbles with a predictable rhythm that repeats every eight and a half years. This is very important. First of all, we need to know the planet we exist on and mankind is chained to for now, or maybe for eternity, if we cannot get out in, in, into outer space, which seems to be more dangerous than anybody thought. And we also need to know about the inner workings of our planet. So I will keep bringing you more stories about our planet and its core, and you can find more in my videos. I think this is a very important subject. If you can support my research, please do so to the links you'll, you'll find in the description to this channel. Please tell others about my research. Uh, please uh, like my videos. Thank you.